guys, this is exciting. Another episode of Game Talk Live, a video game talk show where every day, Monday through Friday, we talk about the top gaming news stories of the day, not just the week, the day. Nintendo news. Don't get too excited, I know. Oh, the com- man. The company had an operating loss of close to half a billion dollars. That news was released today. AI threw up the graphic. Wow, that's a lot. It's a lot of money. AI, you are giggling. Well, they don't have an operating loss. Uh, apparently, they have an operating loss, uh, according to this graphic. <laughs> oh, well, I didn't make this graphic. That's uh, Let's look at... Uh, well, that, this would make sense to have a misspelling yeah. on a horrible yeah. graphic. That's uh, Nick Aragon. <laughs> look at those guns, though. You know what this is in uh, business terms, Paul? Uh, this is a, this is a, a, in the black and no, the red. No, this is called an ouchie. <laughs> an ouchie. Yeah. yeah. Todd, what's the third news story of the day? I think it's going to be about that uh, Sniper 3 Elite game. Sure is. Sniper Elite 3. Third iteration in the series. It comes out June 1st. AI, just go ahead and play it. This is all gameplay. Probably Your the best part about this game, uh, the price game. drops on it very quickly. Uh, you can take it for what it's worth. Remember, Sniper V2 came out. It was probably 40 bucks. It dropped down to 30 very quickly. This is listed uh, next gen and previous gen consoles for 40, 50 on next gen. It's going to drop very quickly. Paul gave some great reasons to play this game, but you left out the most important one. You can actually watch the bullet travel down range, and then that goes into some sort of cool X ray mode where you see the bullet go into your victim's head, yeah. skull, brain, and everything, and blown up. Now, you might think you'd get tired of seeing that. You don't. One of the things we do on this show, we are a Twitch show. We're on the front page of Twitch every day. We like to reach out to the Twitch community. Oh, we do? That's right. We'll promote your stuff on Twitch. If yes. you're a streamer, if you're somebody that wants to get your stream, your channel out there, you follow me on Twitch, you send me a highlight, we'll promote it on this show. What does a Twitch highlight look like? Well, today we've got NQH Scrumplet, correct? Oh. That's right. Oh. AI, what are we showing off today on, on uh, Scrumplet's this channel? This is an old PS1 game called Tomba 2. Oh, and sure. Roller coaster. the most difficult oh, part of this game. Okay. Let's take a look. Come on. We did it! Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! 24 seconds to it! Alright, well that was great. Yahoo it said. And that's from uh, Tumba. NQH right. Scrumplet. NQH Scrumplet. Next story we're going to talk about here is about World of Warcraft. Yes. Uh, you know, from Diablo 3. Uh, One million pre-sold for the expansion pack that's uh, coming out. Yeah. Warlords of Drina, why do you... Well, that's one million level 90 boosts, which means there'll be about one million new people and looking for raid groups that don't know what the hell they're doing. Let this will me, be fantastic. Let me, all right, sure, let me step back slightly. Uh, we had news yesterday that WoW was now surpassed by Dota 2 in terms of subscribers. Around seven and a half million people have subscribed yeah. to WoW. That's down from about five million from 2010. I know, sad news, guys. The business, though, that they've won- they've pre-sold one million of these expansion packs. I might actually jump back into the game because it seems like they're doing a couple things right, that they failed a little bit for us WoW players with Mists of Pandaria. Give me one. Blizzard effectively reduced the number of classes in the game, so pretty much everyone could do everything. If you're a Frost Mage, you might still be able to do a Flame Strike. If you're a Fire Mage, you'll probably be doing Cones of Cold. What they're doing with the new expansion is they're actually making some of the class specifications mean something, and by adding in the Mythic 20-man raids, pretty much every class with their unique participatory skills will be required to fill out those groups so everybody in the future should have their own specialty function and you'll have those aha moments in the game. If the, ex- if the expansion pack comes out second half of 2014. Other news that I want to talk about as part of this, the WoW movie, yes there's a film for those that weren't privy, is going to come out March 2016. Oh great, so it'll have outdated graphics just like the game. Awesome! Yeah. Principal photography is done, they're working on CG post um, pr- production as it were, that's going to take about a year and a half, which what? is pretty standard. That's for not why time. they're moving the film. That's why 20, they're on post-production right now. They're moving the movie date because of Star Wars. <laughs> well, No sh- one wants to... You, would you want to release your uh, $100 million <laughs> movie when Star Wars is When is that? Because that's Christmas, right? Yeah, Star Wars comes nope. out yeah. Christmas, which is when this movie is coming back. They're pushing this to March 2016. Right sure. Now. The actual quote was, we're busy with other things right now. Yeah, no. So the only thing that can stand look. up against Star Wars is Kanye West, and he's not in this movie. Kanye West he's is the, the Kanye movie. best. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're off. Yeah, that's terrible. Duncan Sorry. Jones, by the way. The guy who directed Moon directing this movie. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, so it should be actually that. interesting, hopefully. Pokemon is introducing two new titles, or are they? <laughs> Graphic. Ooh, uh, Ruby and Sapphire. Hey, yeah, right. what's the business here? Basically, Nintendo showed a quote-unquote trailer showing off games titled Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. We haven't seen these since what? The GBA? Exactly. exactly. Okay, so now they're, they're hypothetically bringing it to the 3DS as remakes, as ports. 
We don't know because this is the only video we've seen, right? AI? Yes, let's okay, show so it. Let's, yeah. let's see this. Okay, this is exciting. And this came out today? Is this what this, this is? This is a trailer, I, I guess. Oh, this is great. Wait, we didn't make this? This is an official company trailer? Explore yeah. a dramatic, well, okay, so a new world, right? Paul, that was a terrible trailer. Guys, can I can I do something real quick and, and make that more exciting? That bored me. Have AI, can you fix AI, that up? can you jazz yeah, it up, sure, I guess? Sure, right, I got so it. Let's, gonna, see, let's see what AI can do. Let's sizzle here. Oh, now I'm interested in this game. So. Oh, wow. Yeah, I want to get this game. I'm Thanks, having AI. a seizure, so it's working. Okay, yeah, so there's Paul Nyhart. Fire in the hole here. That's amazing. And uh, okay. Okay. Well, thanks right. for fixing me. There, now I right. can't drive home. Yeah, you this got is good. It. Skype wave. Thank you guys all yeah. for participating today. We enjoyed your company. We'll see. You. There's a whole slate of programming coming up after us. I'm Paul. He's Todd. Thanks for watching us, guys. Take care. I'll see you tomorrow, everyone. The fate of the earth is in my hands. No choice but to.